wait till I get a complaint about it. You renamed World of Tanks Rage Simulator. Yeah, I think half the community would agree with you on that. Okay. So. Uh, this guy. We'll leave them to rest up. I think that's enough for this turn. And I'm out of cash anyway. What have we got? You may still assign a provincial governor. I can't because I'm out of cash. I'll do that next turn. Oh, what a turn. No spiders in Yorkshire. Just kill a sheep. It'll be scared of the sheep up here. We have proper sheep. And they don't take prisoners. So I saw mention somewhere of the chat, but I've missed it, of a banana and peanut butter smoothie. Was that right? Can't see where it is now, but yeah, that sounded pretty good. Whew, right, well, that was a pretty hectic turn. There was a lot of fighting, a lot of conquering. Some nobles had another kid. Ian fled. That is the name of the prostitute in Bernard Cornwall's Last Kingdom series. Ah, one of them details. I don't wonder why that's stuck in my mind. No idea. She's actually a pretty major character. Uh, okay, so... Do I... I think I carry on the war with these guys. They've got supplies. I think I can put this... this I think I can put this rebellion down, down here pretty quick. Occupy that. It's occupied. Let's just kill that fella. Um, yeah, go on then. We'll fight that one. Just because we'll have some men on the screen. Yeah, I've read Cornwall. I've read loads of his books. I've read, I read all the Sharp series and I read most of them before they made a TV series on. And as much as I like the TV series with Sean Bean... The books are better. They're really, really good. For anyone who hasn't read the Sharp series books, go onto Amazon and find them or go to your library, find them. They're really good if you like Napoleonic history, especially. And then what else has he written? He did the Starbuck Chronicles, the American Civil War. Uh, they were good, although he stopped. He didn't finish that series, which was a shame. Um, and then I'm reading the... What do you call them? The Uhtred Chronicles? The Last Kingdom series, basically. Saxons, Vikings, which I've been reading at the time of playing this, which is quite quite good. It's sort of got me in the mood for playing it as well. What else has he written? He's written some other stuff, hasn't he? Some Arthurian Chronicles, King Arthur. I haven't read those. And the Longbow stuff. Uh, Cressy and Agincourt. Well, one of the books was called Agincourt. Uh, yes, read some of those as well. They're all pretty good. There's often a lot of them. I mean, Sharp, Sharp was his first ones. Actually, just just put that on normal march. I think Sharp was his first series, and you kind of feel like every other historical period he writes is just Sharp, but with a longbow, or Sharp, but with an American Civil War musket, or Sharp, but with an army of Saxons. But they're all good. There's nothing really wrong with that. They're all good stuff. Yeah, I like the way, I mean, the references you mentioned. I love the way that, uh, whoops, stop. Get in there. Everything. Kill that lot. Should have had the horses on this side, shouldn't I? See, I'm too busy reading chat and not focusing on the on the fight. Let's get these horses in. I've got the archers. Just shoot them. Archers, just shoot them. Mm, not killing many of them. Right, get my archers out of the way. We don't want them doing that anymore. Yeah, I mean, you can. The, the Cornwall's historical books are great because he uses real characters, sort of borrows a bit of history to make them uh, sort of fit in. But you can track the references and all the battles, you can look it up. And that's kind of what fuels an interest in history. You read stuff like that, you love the story. You think, oh, I'm going to go and learn what really happened there. 
and uh, yeah, it just all follows in. I think it's, I think it's really cool. I love that sort of stuff. The SPQR Roman detective stories. No, did, did Cornwall write those, or are they someone else? I'll come across them. Nearly ran a sheep over in Yorkshire, near us motherly. That, that's a hanging offence. Get in trouble for that. Drunk farmers turning up with shotguns and showing us how well they can shoot flying bottles. That sounds like fun. One of them wasn't me, was it? I'm sure I'd remember doing that. Okay, so we're we're putting down this rebellion. We're slowly conquering land. Uh, we'll go and take this place next because I think they could quickly grab it if I don't. We will do our utmost. Good. All's good so far down there. Did I have a load of stuff to do over here? I know I've I know I've got myself into trouble with these lot. Ah, uh, if that's all there is, I'll just go and conquer them at the end of this fight. How do my allies do? Do they, they fight the enemy off? I think so. I think that's gone pretty well. Um, I've got some money. I should upgrade these places. What's that? Moot Hill. The laws of the land are more effectively dispensed from a place of sacred importance. I get reduction to corruption. No idea what corruption does. Should build something here. Blacksmiths, grain pits, extra supplies, extra food. Might do that. Tithe hall. That does more, but it upsets the people as well, so I'll go for the grain pits. Oh, okay, I might, uh, thanks Harmless, I might check some of those books out. Right, where are we at? We cannot. All right, okay, I see, I see. The men have trained for this. Have they already moved this turn. I don't think so. Well, if I get here, that's still in friendly territory, so they'll use less supply. Or is it? Yeah, it is friendly territory, so they'll use less supplies, and I can go and take Jip Switch. That's got to be Ip Switch. Got to be Ipswich. And here I can just go straight and take any of these. There's an enemy army up there, but it's not a problem. Who's that? Oh, Viking army from East Anglia. Maybe I should go and meet them. Right, does it tell me? Grantaburg. That's got to be Grantham? Uh, minor settlements. Doesn't tell me. I'm trying to work out which province owns which little settlements. Could wipe out these Grantabrew people pretty quick. Right then, where's Alfred's army gone? We await your commands. Let's go get that one. Sort of links links the realm up a bit. Occupy that. Taken. You can stay there, return. I'll just repair that cattle pen. <gasps> what? What? Oh my god. How far are we going to go back to that? Is that... Right, let me just switch the scene. <laughs> That's not good. That's not good when the game crashes. That's the first time I've seen it crash, but we'll see if we can get back in pretty quickly. Hmm. I guess I've just uh, just pushed the servers or the game just a little bit too far. It didn't like that. Should load up back up in a minute. Fingers crossed. 
How far back did it go? Because I haven't manually saved the game, so I'm hoping that autosave isn't too far back. Otherwise, that's going to be mm, something to cry over. Right, let's get in. Um, campaign. Continue. I'm going to load it from the last autosave. It was from... It was from nine minutes ago, so let's go and see how far back I've got to do this. My strategy was too intense for the CPU. I think you might be right. Let's see if this is going to come back in. When I click on that. Big black screen at the moment. It's working on the computer. Just OBS isn't, uh, isn't responding. Everything's died? The... Can you guys still hear me? Surely the microphone hasn't died. I haven't muted anything, not that I know of. Yeah, lost in the void. You guys can still hear me okay? Stream looks to be okay. Microphone's being picked up. You can hear and see me. Great. Thank you very much, Harmless. That's... I'm off. Yeah, uh, these streams are laid back, and hopefully they will join nice people. This isn't going to be any salty, agitated sort of stream from ever from me. It's just going to be a great place to chill out, have a chat with everyone, just enjoy the games. Uh, no pressure, no seriousness. It's just going to be pretty good vibes, I hope. Apart from when games crash. That, that doesn't add to good vibes. Right, where do we get to? I think I'm a little bit behind. I'm out of cash. So this is obviously the, the end of the last turn. Right. I'm guessing it saves it at the end of the turn. Just before you hit the end turn button. That must trigger the auto save. You can see me, but then again, you're right behind me. That's twice I've fallen for that. I'm not going to fall for it a third time. No spiders. No creepy people sneaking up behind me, I hope. You should watch some of the Counter-Strike Ghost streams. They're really intense and usually pretty salty. I've watched I've watched all sorts of things. Um, I've watched plenty of World of Tank streams that get pretty salty. And I've seen other streamers on other games where I've just dropped in and they're just shouting and screaming. And what is the point in playing if you're going to get that worked up about it? I mean, it's good that you care about something because you can't get worked up about something if you don't care about it. But it's not going to help your performance any going like that and there's the old pro archer coming out and talking in me again right so everything's good oh we're back to assigning provincial governments uh governments governors I, I don't know if i want to put a guy in there i guess i should but then it's going to be i'm going to have this issue with the estates aren't i lost he lost his governor position did he did I assign someone that I shouldn't have done? Oh well, if he's lost his governor position, you're going to have it straight back. And... Hey, he hasn't lost his governor position anymore. Maybe the estates thing isn't an issue after you become Anglo-Saxons. Which I did last stream, I don't know. This was a real problem last time, but it's it's not an issue anymore. I don't mind spiders, Morel. Just, uh, uh, was it Sergeant Barracuda trying to convince me there was a spider crawling up the uh, green screen behind me? Didn't fall for it, of course. No, 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 no. <laughs> right. Let's A, trash this guy. Well, he'll probably retreat, will he? We're going to auto-resolve that. Because I made such a mess of that last time. Chasing him round. Surely the auto resolve's not going to do as bad a job as I did. And then we're just going to occupy that. And that's another province down. Yeah, three kills. I grow ever stronger. Another enemy killed in battle. The men are ready to Take that. Occupy that. That's looking pretty good. Is there anything to repair? Bod mine, a tin smelter. That's going to upset everyone a lot. In fact, everyone's pretty upset. Oh, that should be adding. No, it's not. I've got a port. I 
Tanner. Granary. There's nothing really keeping people happy. That mm, I'll take a while to kick in. Anyway, that's that bit done. Rixiger has just improved in stature. We'll go with... Oh, it's Forager. Extra unit replenishment. We'll go with that. I still want to, I still want to tick that replace general button. It's, it's badly placed under there. Every, everyone I've seen and myself multiple times just want to hit that button instead of the tick down here. That will start a civil war one day. So yeah, a few people upset and then we've got a couple of uh, things to catch up with up here. Um, we took these places, didn't we? All forces in good, order. good. I'm going to go for Ipswich next turn. And he can just march straight out and take that. Nice, easy occupy. We'll have that. Cool. So we're back to where we were. I'm going to set a couple of things off. Building. Chitranquai. Hey, back for day two and chat works. Yeah, chat was a bit of a disaster on that first stream. The first Twitch stream I ever produce and Twitch chat goes down across the platform. And I had no idea and thought it was me. That was uh, rather stressful. Okay, I could build something here. A Grange. What does that do? That upsets people. But that increases everything else. So, church. Go for a church. Let's go for a church. Uh, something down here. I haven't built anything down here for a while. Let's go for these cheap potters, actually. Just get some trading com coming in. I think all's good there. Oh, that's that's really needs upgrading. That's very old. Right, I am going to save the game this time, just in case. Oh, I thought I thought it had uh, crashed again. And what's that say? Building requires repair. Do that. Do that. Repair. I can't afford to. I'll do it next turn then. So I can upset a load of people. If I didn't notice, I can upgrade my spearman. Oh, thanks. I hadn't noticed. I'll take a look at that. Mark broke the entire Twitch chat. Seriously, I thought my... I could see my stream was working, but I couldn't understand why nobody was chatting. And it went on for about 40 minutes. And everything looked to be working okay. And I just... Thought some of you guys had just My deserted me or just all tabbed out the way. Okay, we've got a new skill for a governor. Uh, I think we'll just keep adding the scribe thing. It just seems to be a good bet. Making lots of money. Buildings constructed. Building requires repair. We'll do that before I forget. Cool. In Stanford. Steenford. I'm, so I'm trying to match the Saxon names up with the modern English names. I'm not sure about that one. I'm from... Let's go. Let's go find it, actually. I'm from... There's York. Saxons called it Urferwick. And apparently the Vikings couldn't pronounce that when they conquered it, so they called it Jorvik. I'm from up here. I think that's Catrick. There was a Roman town... I'm pretty sure that's Catrick. That would be about right. Yeah, that's Durham. That's Catholic. That was a that was a, a Roman town of Port Catrick, and I live about there. So, yeah, pretty cool. Didn't think Catrick would be on the map. Right, let's have a look back down here. <laughs> Conquer my home and call it Mark's Town, Markville. Yeah, could do that. Right, so. We've got a lot of low public order. We're going to go for the research. Mm, anything civic interesting? Well, it's not interesting though, is it? Building. It is good. It is definitely good. I'm going to go for military again. Oh, siege warfare. Siege construction. Medium siege engines. 
I don't remember reading anything about uh, siege engines and siege warfare in this period, so I don't know where they've got their information on this bit from. Professional spearmen. And feared axemen and earls thanes. Let's go for some pro spearmen. I'm not really digging the siege warfare. Mark's Mark. Markville. It would make it sound French or American. Okay. Uh, where were we? We were. Who's Who owns that? That's East Anglia. I need to kill them at some point. I'm just going to keep these little realms quite tidy for as long as I can. That looks like I'm advancing through a swamp. I'll go and advance onto there. So I'm in friendly territory, and I should be able to next turn go and take Elig. These guys can just march straight into Ipswich. Oh, actually, I think there's going to be a fight if I do this. Is that the port? Just, just, it's trying to give me a tooltip, but I can't see it. No, that'll put me, that'll put me to sea. I want the town. Occupy that. Got it. So far, so good. Marksburg. That probably is a that probably is a real place. Yeah, I know I know they had siege stuff uh, prior to this in Roman times, but the Romans were far better engineers than the Saxons and the Vikings. And I think I mean it wasn't the Viking style of combat, was it? Siege warfare. They were more raiders. They were more about getting the armies in the open, the shield walls. I mean, history doesn't have great records of what happened in this time because nobody could write. Um, so. Maybe it did happen. Maybe it happened more than we thought. But I just don't remember reading anything about big epic sieges. Okay, cool. So that's fine. Do I need to do anything in there? They're replenishing. That's okay. That army's over there. Did I have anything going on down here? I should have. I can go and take it this turn. Brilliant. On the march. We can have a nice little corner of Cornwall as a holiday home. Sack, occupy, subjugate. What's this do? The conquered faction will become a vassal kingdom of yours. Um, I'll occupy it, I think. Vassal kingdoms are okay, though. They can sort of sort themselves out. Go on, let's do that. Because it's an option that I haven't seen before. Blame the illiterate peasants. Well, you know, they didn't have cameras. You'd think if they had sieges, they would have been taking selfies of themselves. The Bayou Tapestry is kind of like a big selfie. They, they've made tapestries of sieges, surely. <laughs> I'm kind of clutching at straws here. So I am in enemy... I'm not in enemy territory. But I can't select the unit to move him out. Okay, so I've got a vassal kingdom. Let me go and see what these people think of me for this. Um, no, no, they don't like me. He's my vassal though, right? He is my vassal. Remove your traveling cloak and sit down. Um, I'm not going to give him some cash. He just doesn't like me very much, that's all. But it means I'm not at war with them anymore, right? I don't have to go and conquer this bit. Or do I? It's an enemy minor settlement, Welsh rebels. Okay, so I do. So they'll be on the march next turn. I'll go and conquer them. I think that's about it for this turn, isn't it? We'll maybe go and spend some money upgrading something. Did someone say I could upgrade my spearmen? Well, they're not in a town anymore. Let's have a look. I could upgrade two churches. Bath and Set. Tell you what, I'll build an extra one of those. Food production's looking pretty good. Everything's looking pretty good around here. I think that's it for this turn, isn't it? Let's go for it. I suspect that songs would have been written where well, you did subjugate him, in effect, making him someone who was not your equal or partner. Yeah, actually... I mean, there was one of the other vassals that started the game absolutely hating me. And you can sort of marry family members into them and stuff. 
Um, you can pay, make payments. You can just raise your fame and stuff, and they do gradually get to like you over time. Watch it, I'll march that army back the way I came. Uh, next turn, there'll be a rebellion. The Welsh Rebellion. I did I have a mission? The people of Kurno have decided to rebel against us. They have declared independence and broken free of our rule. They didn't even wait until my army get out of the way, did they? Vassalize or eliminate... Oh, oh no, that's just saying... That hasn't happened. That's just saying I've completed that mission. I don't remember seeing it as a mission, but I've completed it. 